Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have a special Christmas puppet play for you today. We hope you enjoy the show. and I'm one of Santa's elves. As all of you know, Santa's sleigh is pulled by reindeer. Well, I'm going to tell you a secret. A long, long time ago, Santa's sleigh was pulled by horses. That's right, horses. How did the reindeer ever get the job? We're going to show you exactly how it happened. Here we go. Things have sure been busy around here. Golly, I wonder who that could be. Come on in. <laughs> Excuse me, Rolo. I've got to talk to you about something very important. The other horses sent me to tell you that we're quitting. We've loved our job of pulling Santa's sleigh. <laughs> But it's just too cold here at the North Pole. We've all decided to move someplace where it's nice and warm, like Florida. Sorry to give you such short notice, Rollo. <sighs> we just can't take this weather anymore. Goodbye. <laughs> Thanks for telling me. Thanks for all your hard work. Have a safe trip to Florida. Goodbye. Oh no! Christmas is almost here! Without the horses to pull Santa's sleigh, how are we ever going to be able to deliver all the Christmas presents? Santa is sure to think of something he always does. I'll go ask him right now. Ho ho ho! Even though it's such a busy time for all of us here at the North Pole, I still get excited about Christmas. Come in. I know how busy you are, Santa, but I just had to bother you. We have a major emergency. What is it, Rolo? What's wrong? Santa, the horses have quit. They said they've enjoyed their job, but it's too cold up here at the North Pole for them. And they're moving to Florida. Oh, Santa, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Now don't worry, Rollo. We'll think of something. Let's settle down and think. I got it. I got it. We can send all the presents through the mail. No, I don't think that will work, Rollo. The post office is busy enough this time of year. Besides, it would cost way too much. Deliver the presents by truck. No, Rolo. That would take far too long. I got it! Let's get some other animals to pull your sleigh. I'm sure there are lots and lots of animals who would like to be your helper. Well, that's an excellent idea, Rolo. Thanks, Santa. And I know just the way to get those animals. We'll run an advertisement in the newspaper. Yes, that will be perfect. And I know exactly how it should read. Take this down, Rollo. Wanted. Energetic and dedicated helpers to pull Santa's sleigh. Apply in person at the North Pole. Got it, Santa. I'll run into the newspaper office right away and have them print our ad in tomorrow's paper. See you later. Rolo is such a great help. I 
better go see how things are coming at the toy shop. That ad in the newspaper sure works. There was gush in this morning paper, and already there are dozens of animals lined up outside, just waiting to be interviewed. Santa is so busy, he asked me to start the interviewing without him. I guess I better get started. Okay, applicant number one, come on in. Hi, dear. I'd love to go Santa's sleigh. you are, but Santa's sleigh gets very, very heavy with all those toys and presents. Are you sure you could pull it? Ready to fly, ready to fly. Let's go, let's go. Wait, 
Not so fast. You know, Bird, that sleigh is awfully heavy. I'm not sure you could lift it high in the sky. You're not very strong, though you're sure beautiful, and I'm sure you fly really fast. I want to fly! I want to help! I want to help! What can I do? What can I do? Bird, you have wonderful, soft, fluffy feathers. Do you think you and your bird friends could spare some of your feathers for Santa to use to stuff the toy teddy bears he's making? Squawk! I'll ask! I'll ask! Squawk! I'll ask! Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I'm ready to give up. No one seems to be working out at all. I just don't know who will ever find a pull Santa sleigh. Uh-oh. Here comes Santa. I wish I had good news to tell him. Well, Rollo, how's it going? Who did you find to do the job? Oh, Santa, nobody seems to be working out. They all want to help, but pulling your sleigh is a very, very tough job. I just don't know what we're going to do. wonder who that could be at the back door. I better see. Excuse me, I know you're busy, but I live down the road and I found this on the ground. Someone must have dropped it. Do you know who it belongs to? It doesn't matter. He left and he won't be coming back. Say, I haven't seen you around here before. Who are you? Oh, I'm a reindeer, and I live down the road in a big cave. There are a lot of us here at the North Pole. You've probably never seen us because we're kind of shy and quiet. But lately, some of your elves have been nice to us, bringing us cookies and snacks. We've been helping them by lifting some of the heavier presents. So let me understand this. You live here at the North Pole? And you like the cold weather? Are you allergic to elves? <laughs> How would you and your friends like to help me by pulling my sleigh every Christmas Eve? Oh, yes. That would be a great honor. Wonderful, wonderful. Christmas will happen after all. And to think that you reindeer were right here at the North Pole all this time. Come along, reindeer. I want to meet your family. We have lots and lots to talk about. Rolo, thanks. I know I can always count on you to get the job done. So you see, that's just the way it all happened. The reindeer were so perfect at pulling Santa's sleigh that they've been pulling it ever since. Oh dear, I almost forgot. Have a Merry Christmas, everyone!